Welcome back to the channel. Many over the last few weeks have asked how do I get a fifth scale dirt oval car. In this video, I will give you how and why and what I learned getting my first car. What I did correct and what I did incorrect. Towards the end of this video, I will tell you about an upcoming video regarding this topic where we take this roller and turn it into a late model. I raced ATVs and dirt oval carts for many years and had to stop due to my age, waking up sore for days, and I missed racing. I wanted to get back into it, but the options for carts, that was done. The first time I seen a fifth scale dirt oval car was on YouTube. I constantly watch dirt late model racing. I love it. And when I saw this, I knew I had to find out. Then YouTube started recommending more videos on RC dirt oval from 10th scale to 5th scale. And I knew I needed to find out more. With the help of Facebook, believe it or not, I was able to chat with some racers. I met with them, eventually went to a race and knew that this was what I was gonna get into. The car is based around a Baja 5B platform, either HVI, King Motors, or Rovan. Currently, the two styles of cars are modified and late model. Some areas run sprint cars, so check it out. You have an option to run stock or an open it. No kits exist at this time. However, I do believe in the future, someone will do it. As of now, to build new, you must buy a car, preferably a roller like this, necessary parts and body and we'll, we'll go into more about that in upcoming video. You need to ask yourself, what is your budget? Even though this is fifth scale racing, it still costs money. You need money for the car, parts for when you do break something, even money for travel. I have yet to find a cheap form of racing. Even though this is the cheapest form of racing I have done, it still costs money. I do have to set up a budget and be careful of what I spend. You will need to decide where you will race at. You're going to have to locate a track, preferably local. Be nice. Facebook is the best way to find tracks and when they are open. In the Facebook search menu, type in fifth scale dirt oval many groups and pages will pop up. Once you're in a group, introduce yourself and feel free to ask questions. Ask questions about the tracks. When are they open? When can I visit? If you can visit the track on race day, or really the best day is a test and tune day, show up early. Talk to the promoter and the racers. Keep in mind, the promoter is getting the track ready and probably a race or two. When practice does start, many racers will get busy and may not have time to chat much. So getting to the track early is important if you would like to get good information. Ask questions. This is your opportunity. Ask how often they race. Ask, is anyone selling cars or parts? Ask, most racers will help you with setting up your car. So ask, back to Facebook. This is some of the Facebook groups that have information on this scale dirt oval. I will post them in the description down below. Fifth scale oval racers is a buy and sell group with discussions on many topics. 
Midwest Fifth Scale Dirt Oval Racing is a discussion group with some items popping up for sale. Fifth Scale Deep South Oval Racers is a discussion group with upcoming events, event recaps, and general questions. Fifth Scale Dirt Oval Racers is a discussion group that has a majority of fifth scale topics including rules. This, in my opinion, is a must visit. Fifth Scale Dirt Oval Parts for Sale is a buy and sell group with some discussions and others must visit. There are many groups and tracks on Facebook. Just do a search, they will start to come up. If you're here watching this video, you know that YouTube can be a great source of information. I recommend subscribing to a channel called Fifth Scale Dirt Oval Racing Network. Dorn has videos on setups, tips, products, and upcoming events. Dorn also has a Facebook page that has many and much information on Fifth Scale Dirt Oval. Buying used, in my opinion, is the best way to start the adventure. Look for sellouts. You can get some really great deals this way. A sellout, you usually get the car, a radio, charger, extra parts, tires, tools, stand, and more. Sometimes you even get tables and lights. You just don't know. If you can, you need to buy in person. That way you can look it over to see if the bearings spin, if the shocks move freely, what engine it has, and what upgrade parts are on the car. Those parts can be steering servos to carbon fiber. You need to check to see if the engine will run. Electronics. Does the radio, servo, kill switch, does it all work? If the car is dirty, that may be a bad sign. Still, check it out. Dirty cars can be washed, and some of them are really fast. Prices of used cars will vary. Check the Facebook groups for prices, but look at the total package that's for sale. All right, about the next video on this topic, it will be a few of them. We will call it From the Box to the Dirt. We will take this Baja and turn it into a stock lake model. I will give you where you can buy and how you can assemble the car. I really hope this video helps point you in the direction to the track. Please leave a comment if you have any questions. That's why and how I did this video. And also, if you want to catch the car build, subscribe. Many times over the last couple years, I have wished that I would have got into RC racing a long time ago. The people is really where it's at. I enjoy every one of them. I'm just going to tell you, this is my sport. I hope to see you at the races, and thanks for watching. Have a great day.